What is the one thing everyone strives for when selling on Amazon, right? Everyone wants that bestseller badge. Everyone wants to be able to tell someone, yes, I sell on Amazon and I have a bestseller, right? And then they can sh they can sh you can show these people your product and be like, look, I've got the bestseller badge. Now, I'm not saying you should do it for that reason, but having a bestseller on Amazon is like the top, right? That is the best thing you can get. And I actually have a way you can do it without having to, uh, you know, try too hard. And I'm gonna show you how you can do it in this video. So, before I get started, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs up, because I wanna I wanna give you this content, but I need, that thumbs up, I need that thumbs up. So, give this video a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, hit the subscribe button. This is all part of my daily, uh, my, yeah, my hashtag 100 day content challenge. Um, pops up over here. This is my um, challenge I'm doing with Josh. And um, I don't know what day I'm on. It will say somewhere what day I'm on, but regardless, let me tell you how you can get a bestseller on Amazon. And this video has come straight from my Amazon course. Um, I've taken snippets of it, because you don't need all of it. I'm just giving you the meat of the content. Um, in the course, we go obviously into more detail, but here I just want to give you the basic understanding of how to get a bestseller on Amazon. So let's play it. And it's going to be Josh talking, by the way, so don't be alarmed. <laughs> Bestseller Secrets. The only way to get a bestseller is to get the most sales in your category. There are two ways to trick the system into giving you a bestseller. First, you have to compete in a category that gets less overall sales, i.e. change your category. Then, you have to boost your sales using the marketing avalanche methods. This combination will get you a bestseller really fast. The first step, of course, is to change your category. You can do this in the admin backend of your page. Sometimes you might have to send a help request into Amazon to get them to change the category for you. We will show you exactly how to do this. When the category changes, you should do a price drop strategy for two to three days. You can boost it further by doing a giveaway strategy and running paid traffic to the page. This boost in sales in a brand new category will launch you to bestseller status. So the first step to a bestseller is to change your category into an easier to rank category where you're more likely to get a bestseller using all the sales avalanche techniques. So first go to Amazon, find your inventory page, head on over to your page, go into edit. And this is how you change the category just based on the page. You go into vital info and right here you've got recommended browse nodes. So you can see we are in pet supplies, dogs, grooming and combs. So what you wanna do is a little bit of research and look into see what other people are ranking for as well. So you can see perhaps there is an easier to rank niche that you can use. So here you've got uh, home and garden, garden outdoors. So that's an interesting one. Technically it's an used for outdoors. Here you can see also they've got home and kitchen, pet supplies, dogs, grooming. So you could do a little bit of research and find uh, a product. This is a bestseller. What are they a bestseller in? Let's have a look. They are bestsellers in, oh, here's a good one. Demating tools, rakes. So they've gone into demating tools or dematting tools, which is like a de-shedding tool. That's an interesting one. These guys also have a bestseller. So let's look at what they have. The best thing is to do is to find all the bestsellers because they're gonna show you all the different categories that people are using this technique on. So these guys are a bestseller in grooming dematting tools. That's directly from grooming. These guys are a bestseller in grooming shedding tools. That's also a good category. So you can see there's a whole bunch of different categories that you, go, you can go into. So just click edit here. Go into find your category. So let's look at pet supplies. We got dogs. And there was a category in here. I did a little bit of research and I found within flea lick uh, lice and tick control, there is combs, right? So it's for a different purpose, but it's for combs. And the reason I like this one is because very few uh, or none of the top uh, bestsellers were bestsellers in this one, because this is was, was a completely unique one. So it might be really easy to compete and get a bestseller in this specific area. And since we are selling a comb, it is allowed to say that we're using it for this purpose. So we just select that, 
we select the category and now you can see we're in this very deep category of dogs flea lice and tick control combs combs very very deep category and we are much more likely to get a bestseller if we get a whole bunch of sales we'll probably get a bestseller because not many people in this category are going to get as many sales as we can push so we'll get a bestseller rank then that bestseller badge will show on all of our ranking pages so we will fly up for everything so you click save and finish and that should update your category now sometimes it doesn't update even within 15 minutes make sure you do wait 15 minutes or a few hours i like to wait 24 hours before confirming whether it's changed but if it's not working you can always do this, which is a workaround. You go into help and you click contact us for Amazon. So you're, you're now getting Amazon to change the category for you. You say you're selling on Amazon. You then go into here and you say you request product page change. You can say issue with a product listing or product page, product page problems. You want to fix a product page. You then search your ASIN number. So you get it from this page right over here. You search this, it should find your product, there it is, and it would ask you what you would like to fix. It will also ask you why should we accept your updates, and you just say other reason, and you type it in over here. You can say category over here, and then here is where you find your category. And actually this is a better location for research. If you notice this had a search box, and when you changed it on the admin page, it did not. So you could search comb here, and it'll tell you many different categories. So here you can see pet supplies, dog grooming combs. Here's the one that we liked. And this is actually how I found it before because I just went into here. So you can see flea and tick combs or just combs. So let's do this one because it's dogs, flea, lick, lice and tick. I keep saying lick and combs. So you select that one and they say, why should we accept your so, okay. They've already said we have reviewed your suggestion and accept your proposed category change. Well, that was quick. Usually you have to just submit that. <laughs> so that's uh, that was faster than I expected. Let's say you have to write a reason. And if you say authoritative website proof, you have to give websites. If you show product images, you have to show images. Other reason. And the other reason is always, I feel like this category best represents my product after looking at other products in that category. Category. The first category I chose was not specific to this product. So that's a simple reason. You're basically saying that my product is better suited in this category because that's what my product is for. Does that make sense then, right? Did that make sense on how to get a bestseller? It's really as simple as doing some research into some categories that aren't as popular as your category, changing your product into that category. Don't, forget, don't worry, you're still gonna rank for all the other um, keywords and everything. Your ranking doesn't change. It's just your overall category changes. And you just go for a less competitive category. You get the best seller in that category and you show up as having a best seller in all the keywords. So it's like, it's a win-win situation. I don't know why no one, I don't know why everyone, why doesn't everyone do it? It doesn't make any sense to me. But anyway, I hope that made sense to you. I hope you liked this video. If you wanna see more about being a bestseller or anything, you can check out our course whenever you want. We've got tons more stuff like that to help you with Amazon. Um, don't talk about it so much here, but again, you can always schedule a free phone call um, with me to discuss it. Um, I'm always happy to talk, providing I have the time. Um, so if there's time on my calendar, then it means I've got a bit of time. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, again, please give it a thumbs up. It means so much, it helps me get more views. It just helps everything. And I like having loyal fans and I actually want to interact with you. I want to hear your stories. I want to hear your questions. So leave me a comment down below as well. And if you want to subscribe, if you're new, then please subscribe and hopefully I will see you in tomorrow's video. So thanks so much for watching.